interrupt this recording to bring you the Glitches Get Stitches podcast. Ladies and gentlemen, my name's John John. And my name Dakota. And Jeff died. And this is Glitches Get Stitches. I'm just kidding. He's sick. Jeff's sick. So he's sitting out tonight. But this is Glitches Get Stitches. Um, we're going to hop into it. Welcome up, everybody, in chat. If you're just tuning in, do me a favor. Hit the like, hit the share, drop a comment. Jacob, I too would like a sandwich. And of course, we're taking pictures. Um, so welcome back, everybody. Episode 106 of the 2GS show. Look at my nails. Oh, that's who's so pretty. Gonna, who's going to say I'm... Look at that. Who did that? Did quickly? I do that or did Scout? I think you did it. Stop. Scout did it. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, what was that? Yeah, episode 106 of the 2GS show Glitches Get Stitches podcast today. Yep. Jeff... He got in his bed, finally ate him. I think he has really bad don't diarrhea. Make your bed, what? I think he has really bad diarrhea. <laughs> if you don't make your bed for 10 years, it eats you. <laughs> uh, <laughs> find us on Instagram, Twitter, Hover, TikTok, Discord, uh, our home Facebook, where the magic's happening right now, and then our apartment Twitch, where I think also the magic is happening. What's up, Twitch? What's up, Facebook? We're dual streaming here. Um, please like, share, drop a comment, all that, all that cool shit. We appreciate you. Oh, you know what? Hold on one second. I forgot. I gotta share this thing one more place. One more tangy tang tang tang. tang. <clears throat> Sounds like you said one more taint, like you cut out. One oh, yeah. more taint. <laughs> Gonna see it. Gonna have it. <laughs> one more taint. <laughs> All right. If you missed the podcast and want to catch up on any episode that you miss, uh, go for free. These are all free. Um, iTunes, Apple Podcasts, Spotify. And for extra credit, check out our YouTube. Please, if you're there watching them, do us a little favor and hit the subscribe for free. Our YouTube is, is it's doing pretty well. It's doing pretty well. I would say out of all of our social medias, YouTube's probably doing the best, um, which is crazy. But you know, we, we had it going for a long time. I think finally we're found or like finding our our niche of what to post on it. They really like the kind of funny videos of like spoof of the video games. You know, we add our little twists on them, and then they also like when if we find out like a glitch or something, and we beat the glitch, or if we find out cool moves or something like that. Are we show them cool? Like we're, they, they're, they're liking it. They're liking the content over there. You could too. So do that thing. Also, if you need anything from GameStop, we got the link in the description. Check it out. Check, check, check it out. Uh, use that and then order whatever you want. And then everything's the same. Only we get a dollar from it. <laughs> you pay the same price. Thanks. You pay the same. <laughs> yeah. You pay the same price. We get a dollar. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> Consider it charity. <laughs> yeah. Uh, on this brand new episode 106, we catch up some gaming news over the last couple weeks. Uh, chat about the release of the behemoth that has got a war. No spoilers, nothing. We're just going to chat, cheat, chat about it. Um, see if it's enough to win ga- game of the year. And then we get real with our wallets and see what's uh, what new games we have to look forward to that are dropping the end of November and into December. We're going to see what, I think there's maybe like three or four, maybe three big titles coming out. We're going to check on those. We'll see what's up. And then we're going to get right. Um, let's get into it. Let's take a shot. You know, like we normally do. What up, everybody? Or are you, Dakota, are you drinking I, water? I have a beer that I'm, it's in the freezer. So it's just, it wasn't, uh, it's not ready yet. <laughs> it was in the freezer? It's in the freezer. Oh, it was warm. You put it in the freezer to yeah. cool off. Yeah. Don't forget about that shit, bro. I know. I'm going to check it in like 
know. It'll... Plappy, plappy. Yeah, well, cheers, everybody, in chat. How we doing? How we doing? Jacob, how we doing? Mikey, I think I saw Ray, maybe. I don't know. One more mm. shot. That is delicious. Let's talk about what we got going on in GGS real quick. Um, We got the AM Vets charity going on all November long. That is, um, we do the 50-50 star split, which has been pretty popular. The way that we do charities at GGS. So that is 50% of all stars donated for the month of November. We send to AM Vets. We love our veterans. I'm a veteran. We love veterans around here. Um, every 500 stars you donate gets your raffle ticket towards top prize. In that top prize bundle, we got some Astro A20s wireless headset. Ooh. We got some BlizzCon 2019 Overwatch gear Ooh. and uh, uh, some other stuff. Ooh. It's very nice. It's very nice. It's your Friday, Jacob. Nice. You better be naked right now then. Because that's what you do on Friday, right, Dakota? No, oh, 100%. <laughs> Naked yes um we had an awesome time on veterans day we had some good donations i i don't know if you have the do you have the donations up on screen right now uh, like the bar you do have the bar the yeah, we're almost to 30 percent, so that's awesome we still have half of a month um to get those in so please any any amount helps any amount helps we appreciate it goes to veterans and 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 it's a good it's a good cut uh Dakota. Hey. hey. I couldn't hear you. Oh, hey, hey. <laughs> you, your microphone didn't pick that up. No. What did you do? Yay! Yay! It just was silent. To pick up. Yep, it was just sighing. I was like, I know he said something. <laughs> <laughs> I see his mouth moving. Just mining. Um. All right. How you doing, man? Good, dude. Um, you've been playing. Uh. Lots of different games recently. So let's chat about no. a little bit of them. Let's uh, let's talk about a game you did that I was pretty interested in. Um, uh, Sonic Frontiers. Mm -hmm. You streamed that. Tell us a little about uh, a little bit about it. It's uh, it's a lot of fun. I mean, it's uh, I think honestly the first like open world isk uh, Sonic game I played. I thought I played them all, but I think I'm missing a good chunk of Sonics in there because uh, I went back and looked at some stuff. I'm like, oh, I've never played that uh but it's cool it's it's very different um i like it it's just the only thing i can complain about it is when you're in the air it's really hard to control like is it something you can like level up or no uh no it's just like the the animation when you're in the air and the camera angles super weird and then like you oh, have yeah. to guide yourself to like be able to like fall and it's just like it's very not fluid it works against you. It's yeah, not it's, it's player really, friendly, I, I user like user it. friendly or whatever. Yeah, and it's a little hard to get used to everything being so quick because uh, there's yeah. two settings on it. You can do like where it sees like uh, they're considered normal where you're super fast, and then just like they have slowed it down. I went with the normal. Uh, five hundred stars, thanks, Thomas. They have like five hundred from Thomas. Let's go, baby. Let's go. That's a raffle ticket right there. Yay. Um, so. Uh, you did it on like normal speed. I did it on one? no. I did it on their faster spin, which is considered their normal. Right. They have that one, and then they have like an easy mode where it's like everything slowed down a little bit, <clears throat> slower pace. I was like, well, I'm gonna go with the whatever the game wants you to do. Like, Sonic doesn't want to go slow. No, he wants to go fast. Sonic want to go fast. Have you played it again since that stream at all? Uh, I played a little bit, not much, just because of everything's come out. I mean. Is it like a thirty-hour game we're looking at here? Or is it like, I, it's probably a little more than thirty, maybe, maybe more than thirty. I think so. I just, well, I mean, God of War is technically what twenty-five to sixty, depending on what you're doing. You know, like all the side stories. So consider that. Yeah, maybe... I've already, I've already put thirty hours into just doing side quests. Yeah, I think I just put fifteen in because I actually got to play a little bit more today. That part where you just that—that's the first part where the side quests like really start mm -hmm. opening up. You'll get like five side quests yeah, right there. There's a, you know there's a I mean? couple I've already had that I haven't done yet because I want to go back with like newer skills, I guess. Mm -hmm. uh, but mm -hmm. yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, all right. All right. Moving on. Let's see. You've been doing Valorant. How's Valorant going? Good. A lot of fun. Anything new with that? No. Uh, we still are <laughs> not even maybe halfway through the, this new uh, this new battle pass. It's got like you know so what we forgot to do today? No. 
Oh, Gotham Knights. Knights, yeah. I just saw right here. I was like, can't even play Gotham Knights. I was like, oh, we were supposed to do something with Gotham Knights. I thought I texted you saying, like, oh, if you want to do it, but I think I just got too involved in God of War. <laughs> It'll do that. Yep. It's God of War. Mikey, yours says Chinese on mine. Chinese words, 1,337 days. I'm going to guess it's I follow it. It's Leet. Mikey's Leet. Mikey, how you doing over here? Um, you played any more Gotham Knights at all? No. I know God of War is, is the thing. Um, let me see what other ones funny. How am I going to hail? Modern Warfare 2? Yep. Are you ready for Warzone 2? I am. I'm actually super excited because it's a whole new map. It's a new, you know, there'll be new metas and stuff up. like that. So it's and like, yeah, go on. And you're going to be doing that tomorrow? That, no, no, no. That will be on uh, Thursday. Thursday afternoon. Fuck, tomorrow's Wednesday. Wednesday. Yeah. yeah, Wednesday. Yes. Wednesday. I mean, right. depending on, I mean, if Jeff's not going to get on, we'll, we'll see. We'll see how tomorrow goes. Okay. Yeah, he might not feel good. That is true. Yeah, we'll see. We'll play it out. Nice. Um. All right. Me, John John, old Johnny boy here. Thanks right. for asking. Oh, by myself. <laughs> you don't have your your partner in crime here to, Damn it. to, to treat me like shit. Now you have to kind of like me because it's just me and you. Um, I'm doing fantastic. Overwatch 2. <laughs> Opal lobbies were fantastic on Sundays. We're getting some new uh, faces in there every time now, it seems like. Um, if you are a part of the open lobbies, let's say I have you as a friend. And then you bring another friend over, which is fine. It's open lobbies. You should have that friend stop by uh, the page, like Jacob had. He's, he's Jacob's on it, and like new person pops up and thing. I'm like, what's up? He's like, hey, and he, I boom, I look at the page. He's liked the page. He's followed it. He just tuned in, said what's up. Uh, that was fantastic. Yeah. So say what's up. Say what's up, and then hop in the games with me. You know, let's, let's be cordial to one another, hey, you especially know, like. If, in Valorant, your your guys are your people that watch are even worse. They're like, rank, join game now. Yes, sir. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah. Oh, uh, like whoa that's there, buddy. Why I'm always a five stack. <laughs> yeah, there you go. There you go. Um, I I beat uh Goth. Oh wait, but back to Overwatch. I we had comp on Monday. Uh, thanks for grinding with me. Show me uh, uh Lydia and Jordan. I got back to gold one. I'm gold one. I was gold one, ranked, and then gold one. Matt, with 20 stars. Thank you so much, man. <clears throat> um, So gold one, still still grinding. You know, we'll see what happens next week. I want the plat, baby. I want the plat. And yes. then once I get the plat on DPS, I can work on my tank. I know. I know, see, but uh, Raptor, you're on PC, so uh, I wish we could do comp together. But uh, so, like, like I said, Raptor, Sundays, Thursday, open lobbies for everybody: PC, Xbox, crossplay, open lobbies. So if you, I don't know what your schedule is like on on those days, we could just fuck around, and have some fun in arcade or quick play or something like that. But yeah, absolutely, dude. Um, I beat Gotham Knights. I. I really, really, really want to go back and level up everyone. I pretty much focused on Batgirl. That was my that was my main. I, I got all of her abilities and, and her ending and everything like that. Because that's getting us some good traction on YouTube and and the reels and stuff that we made from it. I wanted to do one for Robin. You know, I wanted to do like a special thing for Robin, for Red Hood, and Nightwing. But I don't think I'm going to get to it. Dakota, do you think you'll be finishing Gotham Knights? Uh, man, I don't know, dude. I really want to, but it's just so hard with everything out and then everything that's coming out to my camera. I, I can't. You know, you can only see like, your, your the I, top of your head. I know, dude. It's like I shrunk fucking 30 feet. I mean, I'm already like, short. Like, Can you point it down? I don't know. It, it's messed you up. And not your Funko Pop. Hey, here's my uh, co-host Funko Pop <laughs> McGee over there. Yeah, there you go. Pointed out your nutsack. Boom. That's a good angle right there. That's better. Yeah. Hey. There you go. Jesus Christ. There he is. I'll give I'll give Gotham Knights a 6.5 out of 10. 
I'll I'll give it that. Let me see. Hold on, let me let me wait for Dakota to hear. You got my beer. Dakota. Yeah. Um I I, I said I scored Gotham Knights a six point five out of ten. From what I've because I've told- <clears throat> yeah. because of how so the Goth Ar- Arkham Knight is the last one with Batman. Back Batman Arkham City? Or no, is that Ar- no maybe Arkham Knight is where he's got the Batmobile. Mm-hmm. And that game is way more fluid than this game. Yeah. And that was like what, the content and everything. Uh, maybe yeah, sounds about right. So that was ten years ago. They didn't upgrade the fighting any. It's choppier. Yeah. Than that game. Driving the Batmobile is smoother than driving the Bat. Oh, do the Bat cycle, cycle. Is terrible. It, why is it so terrible? It's just I don't. Even I don't even it. ride it. I fly everywhere. Yeah. I don't even fucking ride it. Some of the badass moves. That you could do with Batman, like some of the things, you know, uh, techniques and stuff, they're they're lost. Mm -hmm. They're lost in this game. This game does have some cool new moves for everybody. You know, I like that. I like that everybody has their own skill tree and their way to hop around Gotham and fly and teleport and stuff like that. So I gave it a 6.5. You think that's fair? I think that's, yeah, I think that's fair. I'd, I'd say a six as well. It's not an upgrade on the last game. No, not at all. Uh, it's not. I it is like its a, own. That's like, that one's like an eight or nine even, in my opinion. Arkham Knight. Dude, I'll give it a fucking ten, baby. Out of ten. Dude, the act, dude. If you just. I had to go story, back. I spent it, yeah, it's been a while. The story of Joker getting into his own brain and him fucking. Yeah, that's right. eh, Batman going crazy. Jeff's bad ate him, Ray. So he'll be back next week if he we revive him. We have to get the Necro, what's Necro Comic Con? The ne- <laughs> Necro Comicon, yeah. Is that what it's called? Yeah. Have you seen? The, have you seen? It's probably been a while, but he says like five different names, and then until he finally gets it. Just Who does? Me. Uh, uh, fucking Ash. He, Ash he's, he says like ten. Names oh, he before. does that. Yeah, yeah, in the movie, in the original movie. <laughs> I'll send you the link later. That's awesome. Uh, all right. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Um. Uh. Yeah. Okay. I have a story for you because story time. Story time. You ready? Hold on. This. You ready? Oh, did you get it? Oh yeah. What? What kind is it? Stone Ippa. Hmm. Very popular. Very popular. Um. So. Yesterday, do you know, first, do you know how I got my PlayStation 5? Uh, I believe so. Well, so I don't know why, but PlayStation, and they did it to a lot of people. I'm just, I'm not, I'm not the only one, but I'm the only one that I know of, like out of the group of friends that I have or, or this community. I, no one else said they got, they got it this way. PlayStation sends me an invite. That's right to to register to get put on a list of pre-orders pretty much well guess what i got an invite to yesterday the heads or the pre-order. vr yeah yeah guess <laughs> who is gonna get a playstation 5 vr2 this guy in february 22nd that guy right there you know sometimes as uh half of the owner of GGS, I got to be responsible for investments for the channel. Mm-hmm. Here, here's why. I don't know exactly what we're going to do with it yet. I, I pre-ordered it for either demand. What if the same thing happens with the PlayStation 5s and all of a sudden this thing is worth fucking $3,000? You know what I'm saying? Or do we use it for GGS channel? You should use it. But you need to, okay, you're gonna have. To, I've been in that room. You're gonna have to figure that room out. <laughs> you you were you were in this room when there was a bed in here. It's and still four tight. Or five people sitting. It's about as tight as mine. I, I it's Bruh. about as tight as mine. Mhm mhm. That's uh, yeah. It's about as tight as mine. He's this guy. He's fucking. He's gonna hurt himself. This poor guy's gonna hurt himself. He's gonna fall on his ass. He's gonna break the chair. Then we're gonna have to buy him a new chair. Just because. Welcome back, John. 
I, if you would have heard all the things popping on my knees <laughs> and shit while yeah, I did that. <laughs> you can go back and, and listen to what I was saying. But, uh, yeah, I think I heard your your uh, your nut slap against your um, – So, anyway, I got the room. It should be here in February. I want I – want, I got the – it's the Horizon bundle. Oh, sick. Because there's a Horizon Zero Dawn VR that comes out with it. Okay. So, $649 for everything. Ooh. But my goal is is to kind of set up a star goal in my brain from now and kind of have it paid off by February. There you go. That's, my, that's my goal. After we do the charities and everything, I think we can do it. <coughs> All right. You ready? Trends with b- 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 benefits. Fritz, Fritz, Fritz. Yeah, Jacob, I think it's totally worth it. Just because the way we do charities, if – Let's say maybe the, the the fucking VR is just no one can get it. No one can get it. It's, it's going for three thousand dollars. Blah 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 blah. No one can ever get it. And we have one. And let's say we want to use it as top prize for motivation for people to send stars for that charity. You know what I'm saying? You could use it like that, or I could get Jeff over here and I could climb some stuff as alloy. Who knows? And then Dakota will fly in the February to hang out with us. Mm-hmm. That'll that'll have, and Kelly, Kelly and Dakota. All right, we're doing trends and benefits. Uh, I'm gonna take a shot real quick. I'm gonna take a shot. I do the cute little. How's everybody doing video? in chat? <clears throat> Mike, Mikey got a VR. Yeah, he has the. I think he, yeah, he's got the Oculus too. Yeah, he won it from us. Yeah, I know. I know. I was there. I was there. <laughs> I have the I have the first PlayStation VR. That it's 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 fun. I haven't played it in oh, a while. Oh, you do? Yeah, I did a stream of it. You have it right now. I have it right now. Why don't you ever fucking use it? I did a stream with it, you dork. You, when did you do a stream? I with played it? Star Wars. When? I don't know. Like maybe maybe a month and a half or two months ago. Oh, you did. Yeah, it was at Wait, night. Did you just get it or something? I bought it from a coworker. Uh, that's right. So it's newish. You haven't always had it. No, no, no. It's yeah. It's it's. All like... right. Okay. That's fine. I thought like you've been sitting on this thing forever. No, it's it's hard to it's hard because to see the chat, you have to like take off your headset. Well, that's why, like I said, Jeff would come over. Yeah. And we pop this motherfucker. We're not gonna just do VR streams all the time, but it would be cool to have at our disposal. Oh, definitely. So um, he'll be knocking Jeff over. He's going to sit and read the chat and tell everybody how they're laughing at me. And then he'll get on. And then and then uh, I think the game I got was Make Love to Alloy on a mountaintop. That's just going to be the sweatiest smelling room <laughs> ever, dude. <laughs> I can smell it now. Cheers, everybody. Oh, God, I can smell it. it smells like Jeff room. When we used to do the podcast and he wouldn't turn on the AC for me. Yep. Yeah. I was like, God damn it, Jeff. It's 90 degrees in here. Well. Uh... Turn the AC on, you old man. <laughs> Not even a fan? And we had a fan that I stuck my dick in on YouTube. Oh, before. I remember that. Yeah, I remember that. All right. Treasure Benefits. Let's go. God of War Ragnarok released and it's hitting big. I got one question. It's an early question because we do our GGS game of the years, the Gotties at the end of the year, so we can actually get every game in. Good Gotti. <laughs> Gotties. Uh, with God of War releasing, and Dakota, you have also played Elden Ring. Mm-hmm. Who do we think is going to take it? It's going to be between those two. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a tough one, but I'm, I'm going to stick with God of War. You saying God of War specifically for story line as well, like mainly storyline that really pushes the game. Okay, the storyline takes over the just exploring I mean, on your yeah, own. Yeah, I mean they're both great. I think the exploring of Elden Ring is, is <laughs> awesome, but I think the story can uh, that God of War has really drives the game to everything. Yeah, um, I want. I'd be interested to see first month sales like against each other and see because remember 
Elden Ring sold like 10 million copies mm-hmm. in fucking a week or something like that. Um, the only reason so Elden Ring would sell more is because you know it's uh, God of War is only on PlayStation, so there's that's the reason. That if if anything, true. Elden Ring is gonna have more sales because it's on multiple platforms. Fuck, I didn't even think about that until right now. You're right, it is. So we can't even do it. that. That, that, that can't that even way, come no. into play. No, it has to just be gameplay. It has to be like strictly boats. Then I shall wait to make my decision, and because I beat Elden Ring. So I'm going to wait to make my decision until I be. I want to see what all this motherfucker offers. I'm going to do all the side quests. I'm, I'm trying to make this the second game that I 100%. Oh, yeah. Um, I, I think these are the type of game. If you do like um, Horizon or, or um, Ghost of Teen, Ghost of Tsushima, if you just do everything, you pretty much have, let's say there's 50 trophies. You'll have 48 of them. Then you just got to look and see like, oh, you got to dress up in this uniform and go stand mm-hmm. over here. You know what I mean? To get those. I think I can do it. I think I can do it. I'm going to try I, for I it. I think the hardest part would be getting all the birds, all the Odin's. Uh, those are always the hardest for me is like to complete a game is like getting all the little fucking little tedious, like all so, the comics and Spider-Man or like backpacks. Whatever. Bro, I, I don't know, but I think I've been on my bird game. Yeah. <laughs> I know my bird law. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Have you turned any in yet? Yeah. Okay. Cool. Two. I, I think I just got enough to where they were like, go back for your third one or something like that. Nice. Uh, let's see. Raptor Jesus. The Elden lore is loose, but God of War versus Elden Ring. God of War is more polished, but Elden Ring was really good and will stand up. It will stand up. They're, they're, like IGN, they already put their list out of game. I guess they're not going to wait for december and those games that come out for some reason they're gonna put their list out now they have straight on it which don't get me wrong straight is a, ga- a great game but a six hour game against a hundred out take the f- it's gonna put it on an indie list it's not gonna beat god of- it's fucking stray man it's a, it's a great cat game but fuck it's a six hour cat game can't upgrade and tear someone's fucking head off I think you're just mad because you didn't get the new cat stream. I think we're all upset about it. Too. I'm doing a cat stream. I'm going to do it this month. It's going to be a weird fucking random cat stream because I <laughs> the Halloween's over. But y'all paid for it, so you're going to get it. <laughs> uh, <laughs> trying to figure out how to tie it into something and not just be a freak. But <laughs> hey, You know what? Never know. That'll be our highest viewed stream. Hopefully. 300,000 people. <laughs> all right. Moving on. Channing Tank Yum <laughs> will be back for Magic Mike's Last Dance. And uh, uh, just a little FYI, I already got everyone in GGS front row seats in IMAX. To oh, see dude. those wings. <laughs> to see those wings dangle. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> it touched my lip. It's 3D. No, daddy, no. <laughs> oh hell yeah um all right let's talk about witcher 3 the show that's on netflix <laughs> uh all right so playstation 5 oh i don't is it just it's uh, uh xbox series is it for x, everything xbox series x and uh, playstation 5 okay we'll get a upgraded uh what is it like 60 fps kind of thing i believe so it's not a whole rework of it. It's just upgraded graphics. Correct. All right, I'm in. I've never played it. I've never played Witcher 3. Sadly. I mean, I've played it. I probably put 10 hours into it. And there's a lot more to put in than 10 it's, hours. It's, uh, yeah, easily. So here, here's what I'm wondering. I own the, the physical copy. I have to, I had you, I did too, so I'm not sure exactly. Maybe we have to, uh, maybe we, like it just gives you a patch if you own it. I mean... I put it in there and download it and then do the tang. Yeah, Jamie, Jamie. five hundred stars. Woo! That's that's a raffle ticket. What's up, sis? <clears throat> All right. Well, I'm excited. Um. Oh, so more Witcher news, and you're a big witch. Are you, I don't. I think Jeff might have us both beat on the Witcher fanatic, but you're pretty. You're beat oh, I love too. You're, you're, oh yeah. What's this Michelle Yao Witcher thing that I see? Mm, that I couldn't tell you. I'm actually going to look it up now because I'm not familiar with. 
Yeah, it, it was a trailer that dropped. It's oh, it's Witcher. Uh, it's I think it's something. A, it's, I think it's a like a like a sideshow. Champ in the house, Raptor Jesus, Cyberpunk. Speaking of CD Red, will have its first paid DLC. I can't wait. You know what? Cyberpunk was uh, I I played it on console. Uh, Raptor oh, Jesus right. Gaming, and it was the worst experience of my gaming life. I still beat it. But your shoulders off. I still beat it. But I, it never was its full. It was never its full capacity. So when that DLC comes out for uh, Cyberpunk, I will finally do the upgrade on PS5 for the visuals, and then do the DLC, which I am excited about. So what it, takes, gonna say it takes place uh, twelve hundred years before Geralt and everything like that, like with elves and stuff like that. Probably even, maybe even before the actual Witchers. So or I maybe love like Michelle the first Yow. Witcher. I love Michelle Yao. She used to be Jackie Chan's fucking right hand girl. They'd be fucking people up and doing their own stunts and shit. I love. Her. All right, and then everybody's pissed that that Henry Cavill's out, and what's his name, Chris Hemsworth, <laughs> <laughs> is gonna be Geralt. How are you gonna do that? How are you gonna switch Superman? Y'all fucking idiots. And you know he left because they didn't like what the directors were doing with it. That's why he left. He said it. If y'all fuck this up, I'm going to leave. I mean, he knows everything about he's Witcher. he's a nerd. Oh, he, 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 he knows everything about Witcher, man. He recites uh, shit from the books. He fucking loves it. It's a, like, this is his passion. This is his Deadpool kind of thing, but it didn't take 40 years to make. But, uh, right. you know, uh, like, this is his thing besides Superman. Oh, well. Now we'll get to see Chris Hemsworth. Is, so there, is there going to be another season with Cavill and then yeah, I believe Hemsworth, we get one more season because it'll one be match. the third season and then the fourth season I believe is when we'll get Chris. Ah. Yay, Soul Tamer! That's fantastic. All right. Um, shit. I have one here, but this is very towards jeff but i'll just bring it up next time too well all right before we get into that so horizon zero dawn like we were just talking about on the playstation vr they're having an mmo developed yeah have you heard about this i, I uh yeah i posted i don't look at too far into it but it's gonna be by the people who made uh guild wars, guild wars so what 2. the fuck is it gonna be dude you probably get to pick your race and everything and just, just in that open world i mean it's like world warcraft and, shoot and guild the, wars and the mechanical robots yeah that'll probably be like, little thing, like, oh, go fetch fucking 17 raptors. Uh, oh. Yes, and now let me into your guild. Mm-hmm, exactly. Sweet. An inventor created a headset that will kill you in real life when you die in a game. Have you seen that, Dakota? <laughs> yeah, Jesus Christ. So, what it, what it is, is, it's like, there's three things on the top of the headset. They're triggered explosions that when you die... In a real game, game over. It's a VR headset. You, you, yeah, you die in real life. It fucking explodes your fucking brain out of everywhere. Um, so uh, I just pr- gifts ideas for Jeff this Christmas. <laughs> Get good. <laughs> um, but here, here, here's my question. And chat, this is for you guys too. If you had to wear this headset. This VR death headset. What game would you pick that you had your best chance of not dying in? Mm, easy. What would you do, Dakota? Barbie's Dream House. Barbie's Dream House. Yeah, you can't okay. die in Barbie's Dream House. So, like, so yeah. you're just beating it. You're just going around it. Everything. <laughs> Let's get kicked by a fucking horse, you know? Ken's like, you bitch, you cheated on me. With my best friend, Ralph. Ralph. I think he said his name is Ralph. I said Ralph. Here, all right. Starcraft. All right, let's say, let's take out, let's take that loophole out. If there was, let's put in a game where you die. What game do you think you would have the best chance of playing and not dying from start to finish? Raptor said he'd be playing Starcraft. Jacob said he'd be doing Diablo. I'm going out swinging. Dakota, what are you, what are you picking? Uh, I don't know, man. Maybe uh, Super Mario. I can't bro. hear you if you're talking right oh, now. Oh, I'm talking. 
You're, you're, why isn't it picking your voice up? Uh, the, it's picking my voice up on the stream, but maybe just not through Discord. Oh, okay. Uh, I don't know, man. I guess maybe Super, uh, Mario from like Super Mario uh, uh, World. You pick a, you're going to die in a Mario game. I don't know, man. I, I think I'd die I more. Here's what I picked. I picked Final Fantasy VII because if you start grinding early, you can outgrind your bosses. You might come into one that's fucking tough, but if you grind it enough, if you spend enough time grinding, you could possibly outbeat that boss, but maybe still die. But that was that was all I could think of. That maybe. Yeah, I don't know, man. <laughs> but VR also puts a whole new uh, Ray, uh, retrospect on it. it. Ray said stray. Strays, dude. I died on straight a lot. Those little fucking little things that fuck, right. fuck with your shit. Fucking Animal Crossing. <laughs> yep. <coughs> All right, let's move on. Kevin Conroy, the OG voice of Batman. Motherfucker had 14 movies doing the voice, 13 games. Whatever the fuck else there is to be Batman's voice, he did. Uh, everyone's mourning him in his own way, but here to talk about it is body positive Batman. Body positive Batman is here to have our saving grace. And there he is. Look at him, everybody. Look at him. <laughs> Kevin! Kevin Conroy! Why? Oh, God. Alfred, get the chunky monkey ice cream. It's going to be a shit show tonight. I'm a wreck. I'm a wreck. Dakota, good to see you again. Hello. Hello, body. Whatever. <laughs> All right. Your body positive Batman. Diabetes okay. Batman. Sorry. Don't. Uh, fat Bat. You've been hanging out with Joker. Diabetes Fat Bat. That's some other anyway let me pull myself together batman the animated series was my absolute favorite and don't even get me started on the arkham game series true masterpiece <laughs> i'm so emotional right now uh, who's gonna do it who's gonna do it dakota who's gonna be the voice now hopefully you the real batman Who's going to be the voice of vengeance in the night? Ponyboy Pattinson? Vengeance. I don't think so. Okay? He barely got a second movie deal. I'm looking at my... Uh, first Wendy's commercial deal. You know what? Wait. Could it... Could it be me? Could it be... The Batman that everyone expects to stand up and give a hundred and ten percent into being what are you eating? The best Batman I could ever be. Hold on, wait a second. I got something on my end. Alfred, what was that? <clears throat> mm hmm. You got chip dust everywhere. Okay. All right, you know what, guys? Actually, I'm going to head out. They just opened up a new Kane's Chicken in Mesa Riverview, so that will actually get in the way of all that other stuff I said about being better and, oh, uh, you know. I actually nominate Brendan Fraser for the job. <laughs> Kevin, I love you so much. Batman, out. Ch -ch. All right, thanks, Diabetes Fat Bat, for getting chip dust all over the microphone. Um, when John gets back, he'll have to wipe that off. It's kind of everywhere. Uh, oh, hey, John, I didn't. Uh, oh, I used the bathroom. Yeah, what I, did I miss? You somebody got chip dust all over your your mic there? Yeah. Is it Cheetos? Yeah. Gremlin uh, coming here? I don't know. It's really weird. Batman Something was happened. there. Some have. All right, let's talk about it though. Kevin Conroy. We love him. Ah, uh, Dakota, 
Mm-hmm. One of your things that you really want to be in life is a uh, voice actor, correct? That's correct. So this guy, like, if there's a Batman voice, it's it's him, right? Oh, 100 percent. He is the he is Batman's voice. Um, like the next person, really, gotta fucking step it up. I mean, they uh, have they have other Batmans, but he. I mean, he's the well, voice yeah. of Batman, but. You know, they're not doing another animated series, which really created the whole animated series for him, like, as far as continuing with all the other different Batman shows. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right. Gears of War. Uh, fan favorite for you Xbox people. Your only game that you have. And Halo. Well, yeah, the two. <laughs> uh, Gears of War show is coming to Netflix. So... Get ready for disappointment if you like the game or enjoyment if you've never played the game. <laughs> Pretty much that's how it goes. If you have anything to do with it before the show starts, you hate it. If you never had anything to do with it, you enjoy it. Like the Halo show, I I thought it was a good show. It's, it wasn't bad for me. Um, But a lot of people hated it that liked the game. So did you ever finish watching that series? No. Dakota? Did you ever start it? Yeah, I, I watched like four or oh, five okay. episodes. Didn't get you. Didn't get you. Nah, not really. Um. So, uh, you know, you're talking about Elden Ring. There's a, a DLC that's being worked on. Which, it, it, to, it, I heard it had 30 bosses. That's crazy. Plus whatever the fuck else, you know. That's just <clears throat> the bosses. How many bosses were there in this one with little side fucking mini bosses that you thought were a boss that weren't even a boss that just still fucked you up? You know what I mean? Well, 30 bosses, like, just that, that can be kind of vague. You know, it could be 30 bosses in general. Those are including mini bosses as well as bigger bosses. Still, sounds like a good sized DLC. Good job. You know, we spent $20 on the village DLC, and that was three hours. You know what I'm saying? So. From what up, even if just the 30 bosses, think about what you had to level up to kill one boss. <laughs> so I'm excited for that. Uh, Marvel and EA. See you, John. Uh, see you, champ. A, a Marvel and EA have signed a three game Iron Man deal. The. Okay, here's what scares me. EA. That first part. Here's what could be cool. The EA part. They they make some good games. You know who they... Wasn't EA part of Anthem? Was that EA? Mm-hmm. That's Iron Man right there. For sure. If you If you just take the story out and just did the, the that's you're an iron man that that's what i thought that's what everybody thought that was a cool thing about the game is you got to fly around as iron man yeah as EA, EA don't flop iron man like well battlefield is its own fucking just shit show i don't even get it anymore like how can you have battlefield one so that's two ago there's Battlefield 5, Battlefield 4, 2042. Before that is Battlefield 1. Probably one of the best first-person shooter war games ever created. That and Battlefield 4. Battlefield 4 was really good. I think this one was better than that. Hmm. And I know how, and I, I know there's still people playing Battlefield 4. You know, I mean, there's still people playing Battlefield 1. But, they, I mean, those are the two. And 1 was so perfect. Then you had 5 that really shit the bed. Mm-hmm. And then they built on it, and then they took so much away, and then it ultimately shit the bed. I need a new one that maybe doesn't that's, shit. I mean, that's Jeff's bed. Oh. Diabetes Jeff's bed. <laughs> All right. Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. Guess what? It made $1 billion in 10 days. Okay. One billion dollars in 10 days. Which brings us to our next segment. GGS makes a first person shooter. All right, folks in the chat, everybody. I need, I need ideas. This is going, uh, how 
fast can we get this in development? Dakota. Uh, yeah, I mean, that'd be a great idea. I don't know, fast development. Uh, maybe, you know, it's a good fat check. 15 to 20 years? Yeah. We got to take some classes. We got to learn how to design uh, digitally. I just want to know how to do it. Can I just draw it and then someone else smarter than me do it and I get all the money mm -hmm. and split it with him? Mm -hmm. That's a perfect world that I live in. Start on Roblox. My kids are all over Roblox. And there, they... you, there you go. Your kids can make it for us. That's free labor. But, uh... <laughs> <laughs> It's he, he ain't lying. Oh, you want to play Roblox more? Well, you got to finish building. Yeah. All right, guys. Uh, I'm gonna need chat to work on that GGS first person shooter and get back to us so we can all be millionaires and make ten billion dollars. What was it? One billion in ten days. One billion in ten days. What? Yeah, so that means we're gonna make ten easy. billion in what? Fucking a hundred days. All right. Let's get into my main segment. Segment. Dakota. Hey. I just need you to do something very simple for me. While I take the shot, pull up a list of. Oh, yeah. The first thing I did. Well, aren't you just on top of it? Yeah. Bray, I can't wait till I can jizz out a game in 10 seconds. World's smallest computer, John's penis. <coughs> it's big for what it does. <laughs> the inside's bigger. Oh, oh God. It's fucking the TARDIS for Doctor Who. All right. What are we looking at as far as this? Are you going to pull the thing up so we look at it, or do you do? just want to talk about it? Uh, I, I'm looking at... Let's, I can do the I'm just looking, main... Yeah. I'm looking at main titles, no any games, something like that. I know that my wallet needs to be ready for yeah. at I, least two or three more games are, yeah. well, coming out this year. So, What do we got next? Next Pokemon? Pokemon? Well, next, so next game, just in general, is what they have on their list, because I, I go by Games Radar, is Modern Warfare 2 and the Battle Pass. Uh, comes out okay. tomorrow, as well as Warzone no. 2, which will be a free game, so we're all going to look forward to that. Uh, yep. On the seventeenth, we have Goat Simulator three, which uh, since I have an Xbox, I might play that just for the fuck of it. Dude, I played like ten hours of it. Yeah, and then uh, so then on the eighteenth, we have Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. So you get both legendaries. We all know that. Uh, and then on the twenty second, hey, can I ask a dumb question? Answer. And this is real dumb, but I'm not a I don't, I'm not a Pokemon guy, so I don't know. Forever. They always release Pokemon Blah, Pokemon mm -hmm. Blah, Sword or Shield. Yeah. Pokemon Blue or Red. It's because Why the, is there always two? The legendaries. They're different legendaries. So each game so has a main legendary that like you get at the end of the game, and they're both gonna be different ones specific to that that game you're picking up. So if you're like a diehard, you're getting both of them. That's why, yeah, I mean that's why Kelly and I both usually get both because we'll play through them and then I'll pretty much I'll transfer her my legendary so she has it on hers because Oh shit. Yeah. Dope. That's that. Um, and then the next one, that's going to be a really big one for us at GGS. I think for all three of us, it's going to be Evil West on the 22nd. Uh, that's November 22nd? Correct. Oh! Yeah, dude, I'm excited I was for that. that was in December. No, I mean, I honestly got pushed back, but I think this is a pretty updated list. Uh, yeah, November 22nd. But, I mean, we'll have to go back and look. Uh, Evil and then, West, dude, I'm so excited yeah, for that game. Yeah, it's pretty cool. One that a lot of people are going to be talking about is going to be Warhammer 40,000 Inquisitor, uh, which looks really cool. It's uh, guns instead of, like, uh, like swords and shit like that. For Is that a new game? It's a new game coming out, yeah. It's called Warhammer. Yeah, Warhammer 40,000. I thought Warhammer was they already an old They have other games. It's like, like a new Warhammer game? Correct. They have, like, Vermintide and Vermi Vermintide 2, uh, which are fun, but this is going to be, like, guns instead of, like, knives and shields and axes and shit. Oh, okay. Then on the 29th, we have the Heroic Assault for Gotham Knights, which is going to be four-player. <laughs> Uh, which should be interesting. And then for that, I was leading into December. Uh, December 2nd, we have the Callisto Protocol. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Are you looking forward to Callisto? I won't, I've never played any of those uh, Dead Space games. I haven't either. Fuck the But I'm, I'm excited to watch Jet play. Oh, okay. 
Um, no, I'm excited to play this. Yeah, From watching Jeff play the, uh, what is it? Dead Space mm-hmm. games. So we so so the two big ones on my radar. You got Pokemon on yours. What an Evil West, right? That you're mm-hmm. getting that one. Yeah, I'm getting. I'm, I'm definitely Evil West is a thing. I think Ray said he's getting Evil West too. Um, and then Callisto for me. Yeah. All right. So what is what's next? Uh, after that, uh, the second is uh, Marvel's Midnight Suns, which I'll be definitely getting. Uh, it's definitely. Oh, yeah. I, That's I, good. Dude. I think it's gonna be fun. I mean, because I actually like those games. Those are like well, those Baldur's Gate and those kind of games I play. It's awesome because I, I don't think me and Jeff are getting it, so it's good you're getting it. That way we can have the content, baby! Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And then December 6th, we have the Back for Blood uh, River of Blood DLC coming out. Back for Blood Ri- Oh, so okay. So we okay. got DLC for that. And then, honestly, not much really for the rest of the month until looks like the 13th, which we got High on Life, which is going to be awesome. Oh, uh, that that's, is, that's, yeah, that's going to be good. That'll be on Xbox Yeah, Soul Tamer, Blitz. I'm looking forward to that too. And then, honestly, that is it. What about Final Fi- Final Fantasy Crisis Core? Final Fantasy. Oh, oh, I'm so sorry. That one was not highlighted. Uh, that is coming out the 13th. <coughs> December 13th. Yeah. Crisis Core. Evil West. Kalisto. I think those are the three that I that I'm that I'm eyeballing. Yeah. Oh, and that one where uh, uh, the gun high on life when the gun talks. Isn't JB that- Smooth. Yeah, I mean, so it says on the 13th, High on Life, all, all it shows for here is PC and, and Xbox Series X. Oh, is it Xbox? So I'll have, to, I'll have to look that up. I haven't seen anything on it. Damn, that's uh, that's going to be a pretty big one if it's just Xbox. Because it looks fucking dope. Yeah, it looks awesome. Yeah, I think it's just going to be Xbox and PC. Soul Tamer, you didn't, you were just pretending? Tell me you didn't know. For real. Oh, yeah, dude. There's a new... They're remaking it. Crisis Core fucking thing. On the 13th. Mark with the six. Crisis Core fucking thing. All right, so uh, well, out of those, what, what three are you looking at? Dakota? Three? I mean, obviously Pokemon. Um, yeah. And then Evil West... And then, uh, that I'm actually really, really looking forward to would be High on Life. Like okay. Marvel Minutes is gonna be a lot of fun, but like I like it's not like a like a must play at that point. Oh yeah. But High on Life, I mean, that's gonna be awesome. Sweet dude. And if it's Xbox, that'll be all you, dude. Yeah. Getting that content. I mean, hitting it so hard. Oh uh, yeah. Uh. All right, folks. That's all we got today. Short and sweet. Uh, the little duo stream, like we said, Jeff's bed ate him. We have to get the next Comic Con and, 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 and get him out of there. So we're going to need some magic spells. Oh, hold on a second. We're not going anywhere. Because Mr. Mark Palmer just ran down the stars. Rain. I'm actually going to take a shot for that thousand. I'm going to drink some of my brewski. Yeah, I'm, I'm definitely taking a shot. Huge, Mark. Thank you so much. Thanks, Mark. Yeah, uh, I think that might put us... Is, are we 30% to go? Uh, <clears throat> let me bring up this real quick. Uh, we are at so, 29. We're point zero two percent away. <laughs> so whatever that goal is, add $20 because we got a personal donation. So we are actually oh, above yeah. 30% to go. You guys are amazing. Um, hold on. Where the fuck on? Where the fuck? Mark, what uh, what game are you excited for coming out this Christmas holiday? I wonder if PlayStation Five is gonna be like available for everyone yet, or is it still like 140 by Mark? If people are still gonna have trouble <clears throat> getting it, Mark made it so we actually <clears throat> have it shown that we're on the thirty percent, thirty point twelve. Plus that. All right. Cheers, everybody. Dakota, thanks for doing the podcast with me, bro. Oh, yeah, there, bro. Yeah. Oh, man, you're bro. Holy shit, bro. Ah, delicious. Yum, yums. Treat, motherfucker. <clears throat> I mean, uh, if anybody wants to, uh, I'll be on Call of Duty after this. I believe John, you mean Call of Duty? 
I will join you. Yeah. Cool. If anybody wants to play some Call of Duty, uh, we'll be on <laughs> pretty shortly after the podcast. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. <clears throat> One thing. Thursday, Dakota is looking for peeps to play Warzone with him. Correct. In the afternoon. I think Ray said he'd be there. Mikey. But I know he worked. What time are you going live, you think? Um, Trying to get on by 11 or 12. Okay. All right. Awesome. Yeah. Well, yeah. I, you know, I'm going to try it. Dakota's better than me at these games. There's just, there's no way around it. He is. Um, but I, I, I'm going to get in some games with him when I can. And I want to get in some games with you guys. You know, GGS is a variety stream. So we have Overwatch. I would like to make Modern Warfare slash, uh, uh, what is it? Warzone to, you know, a thing. If we can, we'll see. So I'm excited. Uh, you guys swing by Dakota's stream on Thursday. Hop in his squad if he doesn't have one. And then GGS will see you uh, after this with some Modern Warfare. If you guys want to hop in, we'll see you. Dukes, till next time, bruv. Chat, we out of here. This is fucking. Uh, we're gonna go fucking. I don't know, dude. This guy has zero people playing watching. Oh, we're. I think we're still here. I don't know, dude. <laughs> I just said start raid. Now.